Hello, Auggies Worldwide. I'm Dave Kessler, amateur radio call sign KE0OG, here with another episode of Ask Dave. Today's question comes from Ian Allen, KN4TNT. And uh, Ian has a question about programming his ICOM IC2730. He says, when I program the frequencies with a name, I can't get the name to appear on the screen. What am I doing wrong? Any ideas or suggestions from Ian? Um, I asked him what programming software he was using. He's using Archie Systems. Uh, Archie Systems and Chirp are kind of competitors, uh, but they're both good programs. Now, the um, thing is that there is, you've got two screens in Archie Systems or Chirp. One is your table of frequencies, and it's got a column for the name of the repeater. Just because you put a name there does not mean that that will appear on the screen. There is another parameter. There's another page in there that has all the miscellaneous settings. Okay, and one of those parameters is do you want the name to appear or the frequency? Some radios can do both, but normally you'll get one or the other. Um, I would like to see both, actually, because I just want to double check I've got the right repeater, you know, when I see a name come up. A lot of repeaters are known by initials or mountaintops or something like that. So check all those other parameters and see if there is one in there that says display the name or display the frequency. And it's kind of global, okay? If you have one that you want to list the name, put the name in in your programming. If you want it to display the frequency instead, leave the name off and it will default to the frequency, okay? So it's a separate setting that you've got to look for, and it's different on every radio. So there you have it. I hope that helps. Get out that RT Systems, uh, whip that radio into shape, and get on the air. So until we next meet, 73.